Mira, I was worried. And you didn't knock? That's rude. It? Cersei has a way of looking at you as though you're nothing. It's more than a little intimidating. It didn't go very well. I'm sorry. Cersei is known for being rather difficult. Yeah, rude. It's over now. Lady Marjorie has spent the entire day working on seating arrangements for the wedding. Not on, like, saving my family? Cool. Way at the back. Here with the fourth cousins and the ninth born sons. Ah, Sir Jamie. I wouldn't mind tarnishing that white cloak of his. Oh, uh, <laughs> gross. It's true. And over in Martell. Okay, no, that. The Red Viper. Also gross, but not I'm untrue. I'm told he has a paramour. You'll get us in trouble. We're just having some fun. You're having fun. Perhaps Lady Marjorie can make the right introductions. Who knows? We might meet our future husbands. That's the whole point. Although, marrying a king? I can only imagine what that would be like. It would probably would you suck. Joffrey if it meant you'd become queen? He does have a certain look about him. And he's always treated Lady Marjorie well. Which is more than you can say for his mother. I'm not entertaining this question, lady. Well, I would marry him. Imagine the power you would have as Queen of the Seven Kingdoms. Good to know. I yeah, ooh, ooh, over and... Mm. Let's see. Who else should we marry off? Brienne of Tarth and Tyrion Lannister. <laughs> What a perfect match. Kinda. Sir Bron and... What are you doing? Well? Sarah? I told her to stop, my lady. Sorry, Sarah. This is not a game. I did tell it's you. It's a battle plan. Allies and enemies can be made with every move. Yet they say it is men who are powerful. The queen was pleased by your display, Mira. I'm just glad it's over. Me too. I'm sorry, Marjorie. I love you. King's You're beautiful. King's Landing can be exhausting sometimes. There's always someone to please or some perceived slight to smooth over. I fear it will only get worse when I am queen. Uh, I don't Once think you need to worry about that. And ladies will have no choice but to love you. Do you agree? People are not always so easy to please. If you showed Cersei your true heart, she would stab it with a fork. That's true. You learn very quickly. You were brave agreeing to obey the Reminds Boltons. you of the casually explained that video. What's the casually easy. explained video? I know you must fear what Lord Bolton might do to your family. Yeah, Bolton's awful. I do appreciate your willingness to appease her, as difficult as it may have been. Marjorie's the best. Thank you, my lady. There's been something on my mind. A hilarious awesome. YouTube channel. Interesting. Yeah, ask for her help. I... I did have a favor to ask of you in return. Whatever you wish to say, you can say it in front of Sarah. Oh Sarah shit, we just pissed us. off Sarah. It's about my family. I trust her. I just made her mad though. Ah. Uh, that was a bad move. Go on. Ask. Forgive me, my lady. I wouldn't otherwise yeah. ask this of you. Yeah, anyone would throw anyone insisting. under any bus. It's about my family. Literally, no. Is it? I, I, Snow. I do think Marjorie is what safe, though. What would you have me do? My mother fears our family will suffer if Ramsay is left to do as he likes. She thought, if a raven could be sent to the Boltons to let them know House Forrester has the protection of the crown. I know it's a lot to ask of you, and I wouldn't otherwise, but she insisted. That is no small request, especially now. I know, my lady, and I wouldn't ask this of you otherwise. 
but my mother has left me no choice. So um, can we not hide behind our mother? Joffrey knows only too well your family fought for the Starks. And now you would have me ask him to intervene. Is the situation that dire? You can't, my lady. <laughs> King Joffrey won't like it. I do Think wonder. Think how he turned on Lady Sansa. Like, Please, Lady just don't say anything. Lady. Just let people jump to their own conclusions. That would be interesting. How quickly do you die? I don't know, Mira. If Cersei were to find out. You're the only one who can help me. You have power over him, Lady Mary. <laughs> yeah, no one else yeah just watch them all unraven and unravel. Ramsay Snow will arrive at Ironrath within the week. I would never ask this of you if it weren't so urgent. Okay, little cat. Hang on. I have a tiny kitty yelling at me. I'm going to close the door because I have an office now. But yeah, I, I do think you'd love to see that. Well, I mean, maybe after this one, if I like it enough, we can just speed run. Just don't do anything. Does this also mean failing QTEs, though? Or do we still do QTEs? Also, I think, I don't know. Do nothing? Ah, uh, <laughs> it'll be a quick run through. Very well. I'll make your request, but I cannot promise Thank you, anything. Marjorie. I Thanks love you. I will send a raven to my family at once. Literally touch no buttons. Just sit back and eat popcorn. It would be funner, funny with the horror franchise. Um, The Walking Dead? Or Last of Us? Or whichever the fucking one it is. Fill all the QTEs. Unless you, like, have to keep a character alive or get game over. There are also points where you have to, like, walk, too, which obviously you would, you know, have to go through. Otherwise, you're just going to be sitting here like this for a long time. Seven he looks like the dude in Frozen. Oh, the, the ones, oh, the, um, Lost Pictures play. Anthology. Did you know my ancestors wore the skins of their enemies as a coat? Ow! <gasps> Why are we stopping? No, no, no! Leave, my dude! Uh, my best work, oh, man. Yeah, I no, that... Just don't say anything. That could be interesting. Be I did that. notice the quarry Any was noise? on sale. Like a drowning cat. Stop. As my father likes to say, a naked man holds few secrets, but the flayed man, the flayed man holds none. Pity he didn't know your father was the Warden of the North. He does now. How much further is it to these foresters? Uh, a day, my lord. Two at most. A passive run. What That'd be that? interesting. I'm a squirrel! Shh! Crickets! Crickets! There. Hear that? I know I heard something. Oh, we're staying still. Did Is that what we decided to do? Because I feel like running would make noise. And he, yeah, he seemed like he might be about to... Never mind. Give up. Ah! Oh, yeah! We've wasted enough time already. Your mom wasted enough time on you. Oh! What now? Oh my god, their horses are clones! They left their fire going. That is uh, not very safe. Hey, dude, do you want to build a snowman? Passive malice. 
This will be fine. This will be fine. Maliciously Looking passive. Out. Ow. There's a moth in here. Go away, moth. No one invited you. Lord Ethan. As I was saying, you are young. And there are those within these walls who are uncertain of your leadership. Well, they can fucking leave. He only has but three chains. That means he's not very of experienced. You. Lord Gerhard the Tall, who founded our house, and your grandfather, Lord Thorin the Bold, who sees the Blah, back blah, the blah. What did they call my father? Lord Dead. Of the good. He was fair and wise and courageous in battle. Why are you telling me this? This is boring. Uh, world, I already know these this. These your father's people to lead and protect. All and four of yours. them. But your father did not bear this responsibility alone. He so now you must marry your before mother. Before chose one man whom they trusted above all others. Oh, the that's Lord not Sentinel. what you were talking about. Forester traditions demand that a new Lord Sentinel must be chosen. So choose your new husband. That guy. Summon the Lord. We need his judgment. Oh no. I'm okay with me dying, but nothing wrong. I was only trying to survive. What'd you do? Her, I want my sister. Lord Ethan. Miss. Who is this man? This craven is a deserter and a thief. Okay. This house is doomed! Uh, rude? We all fucking know it! <sighs> Quiet, thief. Eric was supposed to be guarding our weapons, but instead we caught him stealing them. Oh, Eric, that's not good. Two shields and three spears. Is what Sir Roiland said true? Yes, my lord. I fled. We should all flee. It's not stealing if you're taking what's yours by right. He speaks He's true. Right. I have a family Oh, shit. Feed. They're not two coins to rub together since Lord Gregor left us to rot here. You mean Lord Gregor our died. Pain. Our share of bread and wine grow smaller every day. <laughs> Leave the poor man alone. Okay, so... Lord Ethan, I know the people, are he has the heart of honest, the people. This house is falling. We'll never survive the coming winter. Most of us won't even live to see it. We are in this together. You say that, but it won't be you who's starving come winter. Oh, son, I'm going to be dead long <laughs> before that. Lord. Lord Ethan, you must decide the punishment. Lord Gregor always took a thief's fingers, three of them. Now may not be the time for harsh punishment. The men are on edge as it is. Men need to know they cannot do whatever the fuck they please. Their lord will not permit it. You can send him to the war. I will decide. I'm thinking fingers. Take his fingers. He's a thief. If you punish me, you'll be punishing an innocent man. You'll be an injustice, my lord. Uh, I don't think that's Please, true. My lord, my family depends on me. I, Ethan of House Forrester, Lord of Ironrath, name you a thief. The price for your crime is three. Okay, but with half the crowd thief, yelling to lord. kill him. I feel like the fingers is actually fairly lenient. My lord, normally it is the lord's duty to carry out the sentence. Well, get me a fucking axe. I'm to carry it out. I will carry out the sentence. This is injustice, my lord! Stop squirming! Oh no! Oh, hey, we did great, actually. Alright, and that is complete chapter 5 of episode 1. 
just in time.